In a previous tutorial, we discussed how to add an assignment in Moodle so that students can submit it to you through the system. In this tutorial, we're going to look at once the assignment is submitted, how do you grade it, and how do you submit the corrected assignment back to them with the grade. So we'll scroll down to the assignment we created in the last tutorial called Paper 1. If you click on that, in the upper right hand corner of the screen, you'll see a link that says View X Submitted Assignments. In this case it's one, so that means that one student submitted the assignment so far. So we'll go ahead and click on that. You can see in the column over here on the left the list of our students and then in this column that says last modified we can see the files that were submitted. In this case there's only one. So student 002 submitted the assignment so I'm going to click on it. It's a Word document so I'll open it up. Now I'll go ahead and read through it and as I'm reading through it I can click review and new comment and I'm going to put the cursor where I would like the comment to be. So let's say for example that we didn't like this citation. So we'll highlight what we want to comment on, click new comment, and then say something about the citation. Check the citation. So we'll go through the whole paper and make comments on it. Then we're going to want to save it as something different than was uploaded. So we didn't actually save anything yet. We've only opened it, added comments. Now we want to save it to our machine. So go to File, Save As. Might want to have a folder for this purpose. I'm just going to save it to the desktop. So let's say that the file name was constructivism and I might put constructivism revised or I might put constructivism and the student's last name so I can identify whose it is so the naming of it however you want to organize it will probably just be important to you so I don't know what your system is but you'll go ahead and save it then the next step is going to be going back into the course clicking on the grade link and then this drop down menu right here will determine the grade we're going to give the student so let's say in this case we're going to give a 95 could write a comment here but that might not be necessary if you corrected the paper and you have comments on that already so where it says response files you'll click, click browse locate the file Then click upload this file and make sure that you have the send notifications email checkbox checked. This doesn't mean that the student is going to get the grade through email because that would be breaking the law. But what it does mean is that they're going to get a notification that says log into your Moodle course, your assignment has been graded and corrected and then they'll be able to go in, they'll be able to see they got a 95 and they'll be able to see the paper that you sent back to them with the comments. So if that's checked and the file is uploaded, just click upload this file. Okay, and then you'll see it down here. You'll know that it was uploaded. Over here is the one the student sent to you. This is the one that you sent back. You can delete it if you change your mind about it, if you want to make modifications to it. So you would do that here and then just uh, where's the grade here click save changes and then you're done so now you can see student has a 95 and if you want to update that if you want to modify it just click update and then you would be able to modify it so if I go into the gradebook now which is over here in the administration block I'll be able to see that the student on paper one, zero zero two received a ninety five. So that's how you can locate the assignments that students have sent to you, open them up, grade them, send them back, and be able to automatically have a grade go into the Moodle gradebook.
Thank you for watching and have a great day.